Hey, what's up you guys? After Show Reacts here, and today I'm going to be watching some more Charmed. Uh, the reboot, that is. Uh, so this is Season 1, Episode 4, and it's titled, uh, Exercise Your Demons. So this episode came out a couple of days ago, and I'm only getting around to reacting to it today. But it's going to be a little bit late on both YouTube and Patreon. Um, as I'm taking, like, this week off to do a whole lot of stuff. But anyways, um, so I know a lot of people have already watched this and I don't know, you might be wondering what my reaction to it and everything is, so we're gonna get into that. Um, so yeah, uh, let's get into it. Six months ago, okay. He'll call it a witch hunt. That's what scared men do. Professor Thane is a world-famous geneticist whose discoveries have saved lives. It'd be like accusing Santa of sexual harassment. His discoveries have saved lives, but he's a demon? What? You can't be the only student who's treated like this. So you're saying I should report him? Hell yes. Think of it this way. If you don't, he'll just keep doing this to other women. Angela, you need to make that decision for yourself. Angela? <laughs> Looking oh hot. God, no, you have to stop being so close. <laughs> I don't know. I shift it to Go live your life. I will spread pestilence, death, and disaster, and the source will rise. So Why has she got a male source now? Nobody speaks anymore. This whole scenario has been normalized. I blame the president. And you gave it a nickname? Yeah, so it would be less scary. <sighs> oh my God, are you seriously, Maggie? Really? Do that. I can't wait for the elders to get here. I didn't sleep. I'm so jumpy. Oh, come on. As if my unpaid job as the nanny of pure evil isn't bad enough. I'm flunking out of school. You're in school? Of course I'm in school. I'm a freshman. I'm just not sure I've ever seen you go to class. Well, I have. Harry. This situation has us all on edge. I am well aware of that fact. Where are the elders? They're analyzing a 5,000-year-old prophecy, making sure they find the right method to vanquish the demon and gather the correct supplies. There is no room for mistakes. Not a great time for a visit from the local law enforcement. Get rid of them. Angela's mother filed a missing persons report. Last place she was seen was your Halloween party. Poor Angela, she's been through so much. When you're bad at lying. Oh my god, why are you babbling on about Angela's costume? So I don't think I'm saying she's really a zombie, but she basically is. They're not going to suspect she's really a zombie. Okay, I know, okay, I'm just really nervous. You're the one who can't look Nico in the eyes. But she's right, it's weird. So none of you have had contact with her since the party. I didn't really know her. I haven't heard from her. Yeah, me neither. What was that noise? Um, what noise? Sorry, sorry for all of the racket. Anna totally dropped an ottoman. We will absolutely pay for any damages, though, do not worry. Hi, I'm Charity Callahan, interior designer. Sorry, two of my guys are up there taking measurements. So, listen, I I'm thinking the whole boho Victorian thing. Two on the nose. Let's play against it. I wish we could be more helpful. Truly, I don't know why I recognize her. Okay. If you think of anything else, he will definitely be in touch. Is this guy meant to be the new Daryl? <laughs> I don't want to know. I don't want to know. <laughs> Who are you? Charity, the elder. And I am so sorry to have kept you waiting. You're an elder. The meeting an elder this fucking early? I just thought you'd all be Ugh, what, old. I know. I know. I know. I've been saying we need to rebrand. So how do we save Angela? Save Angelo. No, 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 she can't be saved. She has to be killed. Tonight, during the full moon. With this. Don't worry, you each get one. Thank you. Why do they all need one? What? So these elders are just sadists who kill anybody who gets in their way? I mean, that's how they operate. I mean, <laughs> I mean you're not wrong. The original elders were really shit as well. <laughs> 
I mean, we got that demon out of Brian. That yeah. was just a demon. Why just didn't you throw a bicarb soda on her or whatever it was? I can't remember what it was. Ladies, I've placed a containment spell over the Harbinger. While it holds, its touch won't be lethal. However, it will fade by tonight's full moon. That's when you three must perform the killing before it becomes too powerful to stop. There was another elder assassination. That's why I came alone. Security protocol. An elder was killed? Another? Yes. The third one since your mother. Our mother was an elder? Harry? What? Didn't tell us our mother was an elder. I most certainly did. During my opening speech when I told you three you were witches. You know, what? I distinctly remember you used the term senior witches. Wait. Elders are witches? No, I don't like that. The ritual requires the power of three, and only the charmed ones have that. Trust me, this is new territory for us, too. Isn't there some other way? Like an exorcism? An exorcism is only effective if there's a soul to be saved. And with a demon this powerful possessing her, I'm afraid Angela is gone. Okay, I'm just, I'm, I'm just really confused about this whole witches being elder situation, because if that's the case, then... What? Because Harry said that he died in the 60s or whatever, which would mean that he, as a witch, died, right? Because, like, white letters are kind of like, I guess, baby elders. <laughs> so, that means a witch died to become a white lighter and then probably got promoted into being an elder, okay? Alright? But if that's the case, then how the hell did their mum die? Because, like, if a white lighter or a elder dies, then they're, they're already dead. Like, what? <laughs> I don't understand. That doesn't make sense to me. If Angela's already gone. I'll prepare things here. You three get your affairs in order. We commence at sundown. We can't do it. We can't kill Angela. You heard which Olivia Pope. There's no Angela left. That's enough for you to just do this ritual killing? I shouldn't have to make decisions like this. I can't even pass world lit. I know it's harder for you because you knew her, but you're letting your emotions cloud your judgment. If we can save all of these people from dying, like that rat, there's really no other option. Maybe there's a way to prove that Angela's still in there. You think Charity's wrong? I think she's too confident that she's right, and Mom would want us to be sure. Well, don't be expecting me to touch it and read its thoughts. You saw what it did to that rat. I mean, like a spell or something. I'm gonna head home and check the Book of Shadows. Mel did not kidnap Angela Wu. Okay, that's absurd. Come on, you saw how jumpy she was. Yeah, she okay, Daryl. Cops, as plenty of people of color do. Plus, she hates guns. She won't even let me bring my sidearm into the house. So just chill, okay? Maybe we should focus on whoever killed all those people on Halloween, because Angela Wu could be their next victim. Or you think my girlfriend did that too? Point taken. I'm gonna call him Daryl. I don't care what this oh. name is. It's gonna be Daryl from now on. <laughs> How have I never seen you in this class before? Oh, um, I usually sit in the back and I slept through a few. I'm lucky. I only need four hours of sleep a night. I am one of those people. <laughs> Do you want to walk over together? What? We're putting the final touches on the homecoming float. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I can't make it. Parker. Oh, he can. Yes. My bae is not only a literary genius, he also read Dante in middle school. <laughs> My dad liked to assign us a classic piece of literature to discuss it. Sorry, I like this guy. His name's Paco. <laughs> oh my gosh. Something wrong? Just thinking. About? You know, utilitarianism. What's that word? What? If you had to choose to kill one person, or say all of Hilltown would almost certainly die, would you do it? Nope. You said almost certainly. So if there's a chance, then you'll find another way. I know it would make sense rationally, but it would feel so wrong. I don't think I could kill someone. No, of course it would feel wrong. But we have to make judgments based on facts, not emotions, don't we? I don't know. Who's to say emotions aren't just as valuable? Would you like to go to the homecoming tailgate with me tonight? Tonight. I would love to. 
I really would. It's just, I have a thing with my sisters. I mean, she didn't blow you off. It's a sister thing. She just met them. Anima Bevelare. It doesn't make sense that they always have spells in Latin when she can't even. She said in like episode two or something that she couldn't speak Latin. What's what happening? Angela? Mel? Help me! She's really in there. And she's never coming out. How do you know? It could be a trick. There was a lost soul spell in the book, and Angela came out. Not literally, she's still trapped inside with that thing. But what I mean is, her soul is still alive. She's just trapped inside. This is what you've been up to. I told you to keep an eye on your girlfriend. You said Angela was gone, and she isn't. Fine. I was wrong then, I can admit that, but it does not change the calculus. We still must follow through with the ritual killing. A demon this powerful has never been exercised before. Which doesn't mean it can't be done. Mel, you're an impressive witch, but you don't know what you don't know. Let me be a source of- Okay, but she's the charmed one. Elders are here to help too. My mom was an elder too, and she would have never done this. And as her fellow elder, I am telling you that an exorcism is a non-starter. And frankly, I don't have the time. What if I do it anyway? Knock yourself out. <clears throat> you need a voice to speak a spell. It's not happening. Are we clear? I mean, kind of counterproductive. She'll do it anyways. No, it's not the Harbinger. It's Angela Wu. I did a soul spell and she's still in there. And when I told Charity, she couldn't care less. And since Macy's as clinical as Charity, I had no choice. I have the Book of Shadows. We'll find an exorcism spell. Get this thing out of Angela before it's too powerful to stop us. We just need to find somewhere private. I think Trip is following us. Is in Daryl? I, I don't know. Time, remember? <laughs> we'll just drive away. Hey, Trip, I'm at the station. Where are you? Hello? Hey, are you there? What are you doing? I gotta call you back. Wait, where did it go? Oh. She disobeyed my orders. That smells special. Show me an exorcism spell strong enough to take down the Harbinger. Twink. What's that mean? It's never been done. Angela is still in there. I cast the spell and I saw her. You did? But that... That's right. Charity was wrong. We can't kill Angela now. Professor Thane was sexually harassing her. She came to mom for advice and I told her to report it. She did, and the stress of it made her OD and put her in a coma, where she was possessed by the Harbinger. I can't kill her. We have to save Angela. You got a real knack for this. For what? Leadership. Just like your mother. Did she ever mention me? Did she say why she no. left her? No, she never did. In fact, none of the elders knew about you. Years ago, when we were young witches just starting out, she asked me to place a spell on her. The spell was uh, brutal. It extracted all of her pain and anguish over some tragic loss. I never knew what that loss was. Till now. Sorry. Would you excuse me? I got myself together. Of course. Can I help? I want to save Angela. I'm sorry for criticizing you, for making your decision based on your emotions. It's just I've spent my entire life trying to keep mine in check. Yeah, but you don't have a spell. <laughs> what if we could, but it opened to this blank page that is now magically revealing itself? Because you're together? It looks like a Santeria-based spell, unsanctioned by the Elders. She wrote it for us, but why? So you three would find it. She knew this moment would come. 
Her power was prophecy. So she had like premonition. Yeah. The sacred container to imprison the demon. It's either that or a crushed beer can, ladies. Take your pick. It says that we have to lay hands. Touch her? No. One touch. And we all get this pestilence and die. Exactly. Then we can do the exorcism spell. We can. If we use chemical resistant nitro gloves. Parker. What are you doing here? Well, I'm definitely not here to stash a box of illegal fireworks to fire off the five dollar at homecoming tomorrow. <laughs> I could ask you the same thing. Shouldn't you be at home prepping for a study session? The Lion Gives! His name is Parker! Stop happening! I only got into this school because my mom was on the faculty. I haven't known you long, but it's clear you're very smart. No. My sisters are. School's just never really been my thing. Maybe that's just a story you keep telling yourself. Oh, he's really cute, though. Up. But his name's that's Parker. No. <laughs> um. Yeah, that's wrong. You shouldn't be doing that. He has a girlfriend. We can't. I shouldn't have done that. That was a mistake. Oh, you are not a good person. Nope, nope, nope. You do not do that. No. Quick, the compass that summons Elder Callahan. Stay back. The containment spell's worn off. Hurry up. I can't hold it for long. Once the full moon rises, the Harbinger will be unstoppable. Our soul saw this coming. She left this spell for me. What they call her? Barisel. <laughs> what? She had the power of prophecy, but her predictions didn't always come true. Still, you know what it's like, don't you, Charlie? To break the rules and follow your instincts? You don't have to trust us. You knew our mother well. Trust her. Hurry up before I change my mind. Is that Daryl? Remueva la cuesta que tiene sobre este inocente. Y esto sigue al lado. Permitiendo que paz y tranquilidad regrese al poseído. Sana y no te espero. Sanio del mal. De este apóstol de la oscuridad. Float's totally gonna get destroyed. God. He's gonna find out and get killed or something or other, I don't know. Oh, they could just wipe his memory anyway. Oh, I just poked myself in the eye. Oh, that's not fun. you he's like every other cop on the original charmed <laughs> so he's not real there he's not really daryl he's just all the other cops i dealt with officer bailey's death in a way that wouldn't raise suspicions this is my fault you told me to talk to nico i could have kept him away you couldn't have known this would happen it's the one part of the job that doesn't get any easier i'm just saying once again a male character dies for a female character to live. So I came out of my coma last week and just showed up at your Halloween party? Why don't I remember anything? How did I end up here? Blackouts can be a pretty common occurrence among coma survivors. I just remember complete darkness. It was like I was trying to get out, but nothing worked. And 
then I heard a voice. It made me feel strong, like I wasn't alone. For pity's sake, you'd think with such frequent visits from an Englishman, you could at least stock your pantry with tea that isn't absolute rubbish. He's English. He likes tea. But also, congratulations, ladies. You did it. What's up with you and Charity anyways? Sounds like you two have a past. I was born in 1920, so yes, I have a past, and it's none of your business. Anyhow, despite Charity's assistance, the elders will be displeased we disobeyed their orders. Congratulations to you, too. We were rad tonight. Right, about last night. What you said really helped me. That's great. And I've, I've asked for an extension from Professor Brown. I need more time to prepare, and I want to prove to myself I can do this on my own. This guy's just okay with cheating on his girlfriend. See you in class, I guess. He's not even like. Oh yeah, yeah you're right. Like, I have a girlfriend. Blah blah. Like. What? <laughs> Fucking Parker's, I swear. He hanged himself with the warehouse. But what? <laughs> and there's evidence linking him to the Halloween murders. No, they think he killed all those people. That's horrible. I thought I knew him. I can't believe it. <laughs> so he's taking the fall for everything. Oh my god, that's horrible. Ah, oh, the trip went well. Yeah, these three young women are ready to take on the world. Oh, this guy's in a black suit. He's a bad guy. Plus, he's a male. Would you mind switching paint cans with me? My dogs are barking like crazy, so I apologize. Um, yeah, so I'm figuring this shit out. Like, they just hate male characters. Like, it's just not happening. Like, aside from Harry, every other male character is just a block of wood. Or evil. Like, Parker was like, he got kissed by his girlfriend's friend and then was just like he didn't get defensive over it or anything he was just like a block of wood that she was talking to essentially i don't even understand the detective dude going down for all the murders and all that kind of stuff dude he was just being a detective like i get that you want to cover it up but like making him take the fall for all of that that's horrible and I guarantee you, I guarantee you, if it was a girl, a girl detective, he wouldn't have, they, they wouldn't have taken the fall. Like, it's so stupid. Like, I'm just, I'm over the, the men hate. Like, that's not how you have equality. That's not how you have equality. You don't tear a gender down to raise one up. Love everyone. <sighs> Other than that, I like that they saved, like, an innocent, like, an innocent soul. Um, I don't think that the detective should have died. I don't know why they couldn't heal him. Don't give me that bullshit about, like, you know, um, if someone's dead, they can't heal them. Bitch, I saw Harry heal that dude in the very first episode. He was stabbed in the heart. And Macy was, like, dead. Right? I don't know. Um. I like that Harry, like, took the girl's side. That was nice. Still don't like the spells not being in English. Like, it would make it so much easier on the actors as well. Like, you wouldn't have to learn another whole fucking language. Um... 
anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction, and I will see you in the next episode.